What's going on, Red Raiders? It's Lewis Edwards back here with another episode of What's New at TTU. Way back in episode one, we introduced you to some of the renovations and things that you could be expecting this fall in the Student Union building, specifically with Raider Depot. This time, we're back in the heart of the sub with a preview of some more renovations to come. When Raider Depot made the switch from a cafe to a new IT support hub, there was a bit of a void as far as coffee was concerned. A temporary solution was put up just across from Sam's place, but this is just temporary. The real solution is on its way in the form of a full-size Starbucks. Now we are currently under construction on the first floor area. We will open, we hope in the spring of 24, a full-size Starbucks. It will have seating area located in there for students to study. Um, they can work in a collaboration space down there and then um, they will take points. They'll be able to use their app on their phone. So it will have a lot more variety than what we previously had here in the building. Along with the addition of the new Starbucks are some areas students can take immediate advantage of. The game room down in the basement of the sub has been renovated with newly resurfaced pool and ping pong tables. Both were hot commodities prior to the renovation. In the middle of the second floor area, we just finished a renovation where student legal services will move and relocate their offices down here uh, with the rest of us. And then in their vacant space on the third floor, eventually we will relocate student conduct up on the third floor area. One final thing to note, the new bridge in the dining area of the sub just across from Chick-fil-A and next to Pizza Hut. No longer will visitors to the sub have to go outside and around the area close to Island Theater. Instead, it's just a short stroll. That's gonna wrap up this edition of What's New at TTU. If you like this content, leave a like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you next time.